Happy Saturday! If you're new to my channel, I'm Caitlin, uh, and this is GBR Life. And I bet you're wondering, what is GBR Life? Well, it stands for My Good Bad Real Life. Yeah, there's no my in there. It's just GBR Life. So, if you're on uh, this particular video watching it thinking, okay, that's great and all, but let's talk about the real deal stuff. Okay, let's talk about the real deal stuff. Bio FM, Solo 2, or Linktree. Interested in them? Well, let's talk about which one might work for you or an entire other alternative that you may not have thought of. FM. Okay, let's start with Linktree. It's the one that everyone's using. It's the one that most of us know. It's kind of how this all started. You have uh, the opportunity to put a whole bunch of your world in one place and let everybody know and they can just go ahead and click on that specific link. So what does that mean? It means that, okay, cheap your life. Well, essentially that's me. And I have a blog, a vlog, and a podcast. But I'm also on most social media. So for me, I was looking for something to be able to put all of this information and all of this, uh, all of these different things, all these different tools, the creative genius that I am, <laughs> really just like everyone else, and tell everybody where to go to reach all of that. Now, if you happen to be a musician or you happen to be a writer or so forth, I mean, you might have books or songs and music in different places and you want people to be able to get to those places with just one link. Because if you go over to, for example, Instagram, you can only add one link, which means that you'd have to have a website or you can use something like Linktree. And Linktree, it's kind of awesome. You go in there, you tell it every single link that you want, you give it a little thumbnail, you can do some different color alterations to it, uh, put a photo, and there you go, you've got a place. But is that really what you're looking for? Just this very simplistic way to let people know that you can go to Spotify to listen to your music? Or do you want a little bit more? Let's get into BioFM and Solo 2, and you'll understand why. Okay, so now, wanting a little bit more, well, you're gonna get that with BioFM and Solo 2. Let's talk about BioFM. BioFM does the exact same thing, and Solo 2 does the exact same thing as Linktree. That's what they do. It's a place that you click on, and you're able to find all of the other links and ways to go ahead and find out more about that person, that music, that those books. But it does it in a lot more of a customizable way. I should mention, each of these websites, each of these options have a paid version and a free version. And obviously, the amount that you're able to customize is based on whether or not you're paying. But there is a free version for all three. BioFM does it more like a widget. And it's really awesome because it kind of looks more like Linktree, but because it's more customizable, you get to say, I want my boxes to look more like, not just a little box link, but I want it rounded edges and I want it to be colored purple. And I want my YouTube to be a little bit bigger and to actually look more vibrant, more like an actual widget and say, subscribe. And that's what I mean. It's just a lot more customizable and it also looks a little bit more professional, BioFM does. Now, that being said, there is a downside. With your free version, you have a lot less options in the amount that you're able to do. And at this point, and they may change this in the future, but YouTube doesn't always seem to work. The link it doesn't always work. So if you're like me, I'm growing my brand, GBR Life. Uh, it means that I don't necessarily have all the subscribers I need on YouTube in order to say, uh, please go ahead and subscribe so I could build my, um, you know, subscriber list. 
because I don't have just a username. I have that really long uh, name right now, which is fine with me. Um, and I'll get there when I get there, just like some of you, and that's okay. But what sucks about it a little bit is that the link just doesn't seem to work. Now they are working on it, and I did actually contact them about that um, and they're trying to make it work but you will find some of those issues with BioFM. The other thing with BioFM is that it is kind of similar to Linktree in that sense where it's just a box and it has the link inside. So you know it's it's not as awesome but you can customize it a lot more because you can have that box with the link or you can have another box up here that is actually more like this and it has that beautiful YouTube subscribe now and uh, another area that you want to focus more on your website and you want to just add a couple other little uh, gadgets and gizmos within that link to make it just look that much better so that's BioFM what about Solo 2? Solo 2, I'm not gonna lie, it's my favorite. So, Solo 2, I wasn't sure about it at first. Uh, I saw everywhere about Linktree and then BioFM, and I thought these must be the right places because that's where everybody's going. But then I realized something. Not everybody knows about Solo 2, and that's part of the issue. Well, Solo 2 is my favorite because the customized options are just that much better. You can integrate MailChimp if you are like myself and you have an, a mailing list. So people can subscribe directly through Solo2 to your email list. And then that means that when I send out GBR Life stuff, uh, it can get you guys to want to come back and check out my website, which it is awesome, by the way. You should check it out. It is a blog. It is a blog. And there's a podcast. Soon to be two podcasts. So, I mean, how awesome is that? I thought that was amazing when I first saw that. But the other thing is you can also integrate a few other things, um, including if you want people to email you directly, to call you, you can add a phone number option. And the interface just looks that much more professional. In addition to that, it's not so big in, in uh, with like loaded with information. Where Linktree, it's just link, 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 link about everything. Where Solo 2, it's like, okay, we're gonna have one thing here and it's gonna have all of your social media accounts and then just one link, another link, and you kind of have it all, but it's more compact and you're more likely to have people want to continue to click on whatever it is um, that is there or come back to your solo too in order to find out more about you uh, that they wanna find out. Um, for example, I have a, a brand uh, in addition to GBR Life called Mama Koala. It's a clothing brand and it's amazing and I absolutely love it. But, you know, it's not exactly easy to advertise when you have all these other things going on that you have this. And in addition to that, there's also those diapers that I'm aware of. It is spelled differently, so no copyright issues or trademark issues. But how would I have people be able to continue to find my Mama Koala clothing? Well, I have a link for it. And that link, if they go back to my solo too, they can always find my link or GBR Life. And it's very easy for them to just quickly and get to Mama Koala clothing. So for me, I knew it was right because my stuff is kind of all over the place because it also looks that much more professional. So my suggestion is, if you're interested in doing any of this, between Linktree, BioFM, and Solo2, it's to go for whichever one works for what you need. So what do I mean by that? Well, if you just need to tell somebody, I have a website and an Instagram and a Facebook, Linktree's fine, it works, it's gonna look good, it's not too cumbersome, and most people have it, so they know what it is, and they'll click on it, no problem. If you want it to just be jazzed up a little bit more, go to BioFM. It's very similar to Linktree, but you can jazz that whole page up a little bit more, and make it more you. But if you want something that looks a little more professional when you have too many things going on all at the same time and you don't want it to be too much all at once in someone's face, 
go to Solo 2. It's so much better. And I'm a huge Solo 2 fan. If you're interested, please go check out my Solo 2. It's solo.2 slash GBR life. And I'll go ahead and link all of these below so that you can actually get a feel of all three of them. And now let's talk about the final alternative. Create your own website. Yeah, it seems like it's that's a hard thing to do, but there's a lot of different options out there to create websites. And in that website, you can easily just add all of these links right there and have it be one link. I mean, it's it's actually not rocket science. You can just say uh, link page. Um, well, maybe not. I mean, that'd be kind of a weird website name, but uh, you can do that. You can um, create a little website. Um, doesn't have to be anything spectacular. There's not a lot of free versions of websites, but I think WordPress does have some free things. Um, so that would be a good place to check out. I personally use Weebly, um, which I absolutely love. Some people hate, but if you do that, it's very easy. They have um, website builders attached to these things that, are, that make it tremendously easy for you to just really click, add, put your link and there you go. And you'd still have your one page um, with your links and people can continue to go places. Now, if you do have something like that, like myself, I do have a website already and technically I could have just added a page to it to do this. But the reason I didn't is because I wanted to really give somebody else a feel um, without having to think too much about it because I have a lot of other things going on. So. If you also don't want to deal with having to create a special page on your website just to do all these things and make it look the way that you want because you will have to take a little bit more time to do that, I do suggest Solo 2. If you're looking for something very basic, Linktree, a little more basic, a little more than basic, BioFM. I hope this helps you out. Like I said, I'm gonna put all the links below of BioFM for GBR Life, Solo 2, and Linktree so you can see the difference. And hey, feel free to actually uh, click on more than just that and check me out. Uh, thanks for watching, and next Saturday there will be another video. I can't wait to talk to you then. Bye.